Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Wyatt's Perspective, and it's Easter. Happy Easter, I'm filming this on Easter, and won't be posted on Easter, we all know this, but I got this Zeb Aurelios, or Gera Zeb Aurelios, from the Star Wars Rebels, and with, spoiler alert, with all the Rebels showing up and all the new Star Wars shows, I think it's about time to get a Zeb. I grew up with Zeb, he's my favorite Rebel member, and that's very predictable. If you know me, you know I like Thing and Kilowog and all those people, but so I think Zeb was the best choice for Star Wars. But um, yeah, so let's just start this review. Here's the box, it has some purple stuff, some really nice artwork, a read up on Zeb. I just threw that behind me. As far as the figure, you can get him in like the hunching Zeb pose and all the details and his head looks like the live action Zeb head. And I love like all the scarring and everything and there's actually some pretty decent articulation on this dude. He can like go up a 90, he can go all the way around. He doesn't have bicep swivel, but he does have the swivel elbow. There we go. And again, he can bend his like beefy arm that far. And then his hand does the whoop-de-doo and the dickery dock. And then it's the same on this arm, except he has like the gun kind of hand right here for his staff. And then his head looks, it like has like a, kind of like a drop down hip, but for a neck. Or it can be down here and then you can just pull it up there. And then you can push down there. He looks up this far, looks down that far, all the way around. And an incredible pivot. His torso goes woo woo, 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 woo. And then his arms go out here. He has thigh swivel. He has an incredible knee where like you can bend it all the way like this. And then it can do this and this and then this and then all the foot stuff. So he's kind of loaded in articulation for the lower half. And I love all the details. And all the armor looks like armor, all the pads look like pads, all the cloth looks like cloth. And he has those pegs there for his bow rifle. Where is his bow rifle? Oh, it's right here. Then he can just attach it right there. And then as as far as the bow rifle go, you can detach these, and then you can pull it out that far, and then you can pull these ones out, like that, and then it's a staff, and then it comes with these, and you just peg these on there like that. Really sweet, really simple incredibly designed and then you can attach these and I go this thing is kind of like an erector set just like it's so you're so complicated that was so good and despicable me but anyway um and then you can stick cram more is the right word choice cram the thick part right here into his hand like that and then bring this one out and like that you can see it's kind of complicated but totally pays off and then turn his head this way then it can just go. So 
So that's all his accessories. Basically just comes with a weapon and some effects. If you want him in like to stand like Zeb, you hunch him over, bring his neck forward and then like that. Oh, hunchy. So I'll compare him hunchy and then stood up all the way. Um, here is a Marvel Legend. Uh, it's the um, multi Multiverse of Madness, um, the Doctor Strange, uh, I know his name, but it's that my mind has it right now. It's Superior Strange, I know something like that. Uh, with the No Way Home body. And then here is the... Darth Vader from Black Series from the Obi-Wan show. And then here is a Mafex or a Mafex, but it's Mafex. And then here is a NECA Predator. Let's shuffle. Shuffle, shuffle. And then here's a McFarlane. The Fear of the God Shazam. And this should give you like a general scale. And then I will take him up and make him stand all straighty straighty. Let's say this is Zeb if he went to a chiropractor. It's definitely an increase of height, but not that much. Here he is next to my Mando of choice, the Bandai model kit. Again, let me get Mando, all Mando-y, because he actually showed up in the show. Spoilers, but it's really cool. And if you live on the internet, you already know, you know it. So, yeah, I really like this guy, and I think if you like Zeb, if you are a Star Wars fan, if you are a Rebels fan, just if you're a Black Series fan in general, if you like figures, if you like mix matching themes and stop motioning and taking cool photos, just in general, if you like action figures, I would totally recommend picking this dude up. I picked him up when he was on sale, and he was pretty cheap. Um, well, he went on sale around the same time I got this. I don't know exactly how I bought it because I didn't buy it. They did for me. But, um, yeah, just it's a really nice figure. I love his bow rifle. I think Hasbro executed it perfectly. And there you go. I just, I literally did this pose while I was looking at the camera. So I didn't even pay any attention, and it's a really cool pose. So that should say something. But yeah, um, 9 out of 10 figure. Please like and subscribe. Have a great day.